All right, what's up, guys? Uh, recording this video because I like to use my Xbox One controller for playing games on my PC, and it worked fine up until I bought a new controller. And now every time I connect it, I get a problem where it recognizes the device as a controller, but it won't install the drivers for it. Uh, I did some searching online. Everyone said that Windows had released a driver for it and that it would recognize the device and install them automatically. Well, I'm on Windows 7 64 Ultimate, and even though I have those updates installed, it's not installing the drivers um, automatically. So I messed around with it and I found a solution. Now, when I go to connect my device, with the USB cable, it'll pop up in Device Manager as a controller. And now, actually, let's do this again here. Let me remove this so that you can see what it does when it tries to do a fresh install. So I've removed it. I'm going to reconnect it. It'll recognize the device. It'll pop up saying it's searching for drivers. And then I get this error no driver found. So the solution that I found was to right click on the device in Device Manager, go to Update Driver Software, and then rather than search automatically, I go to Browse, and then I go down to Let Me Pick. And now if you have your updates installed, it will show up as a Microsoft Xbox One controller. Now you can click on that and then go to next and now the one that I I don't know if all of these work but I know that the DFU version uh, worked for me so I select that hit next uh, it gives you a warning that says not recommended because it can't verify the compatibility well it works for me so yes and then it will go through with the driver installation and recognize the device driver's software installed correctly and now back in device manager it shows it has a Microsoft Xbox One controller and you should be good from there uh, any questions on these steps or anything just uh, shoot me a comment down below alright thanks